Um, greetings, everyone. This is Dungon, and I'm here on Terraria again. And for some reason, I spawn over there where. Oh, goodness. Where demon eyes are attacking me, and zombies made it in my base. <laughs> Come on. Oh, I don't have a lot of life. Yes. Yes. Come on. Action pack start, and I'm about to die. I wonder if I could swing at this guy without. Oh! I was slain. Great. Great. Thanks for spawning me inside my house, game. What, what was up with that? Why are those eyes taking damage? Okay, um, oh, I have, what's this say? Oh, no, I need to equip that. I wonder if there's some armor in the game, like a way to survive longer, because a few hits from these things and I'm dead, I fear that bosses might be a little bit difficult. Oh, I have a grave marker right outside my house. That's fun. Yeah, um... Oh, he's trying to break down my door, isn't he? Hmm, so I have a little bit of a problem here. Zombies can apparently come through platforms. So, uh, that's, that's not very good at all. So let's um, reorganize my inventory. It was odd I respawned with stuff. But okay. Um, it's a bunny. And he's sinking again. What's with every mob? Friendly mob wanting to go and just sit in the water. Hey, you want to come in? Um, thanks to Opiaz, I know that in order to break these platforms and the walls, I will need a hammer. So I want to kind of figure out how to get a hammer that way. So we have the flaming arrows that we already know. Tiki torch. So wood and torch. Hmm. Stone wall, wood wall, wood platform. I have a hundred copper coins still. So I was managed to pick up my coins, which is something I was worried about. Oh, over here. Yes, I can equip some sort of armor thing, but... Okay, this is what... Uh, meaning... What? What is this? There is a star over here. Another zombie, okay. Cannot hit them through the doors. This sword doesn't hit for much. Hmm. So what's the star? Oh, fallen star. I just picked it up. Oh, and I have it in my inventory now. What's this do? Is, can I craft stuff with it? Um, probably not. Hmm. Okay, but I think the thing I need most right now is some wood and some other things, and that requires exploring the- oh, oh no. I somehow went outside. Exploring the outside of my base more. Okay, so this guy will probably come through, and except they are swimming in water again. Okay. 
Good to know that mob weakness is water. Well, at least friendly mobs, so. <laughs> oh dear. So I have a mushroom now, too. Can I shoot through this wooden platform? Yes, I can. We got the arrow back. Oh, yes, yes. Okay, this is dangerous. So what's this? What can I smell in here? Gray brick. Red brick. What do these require? Two stone. Two clay. I did manage to get some clay, but not quite sure. But I do want to learn, feel, get a feel for the controls again, because it's been a while since I last played, and I don't know. I've been interested in more games. Wait, where's my? Well, Minecraft and picking up certain things and getting other things going. And the reason why I'm playing it now is because people seem to like giving Terraria spoilers in videos for some reason. Um, Ito mentioned it in his latest Minecraft video or one feature of it. And I pause it before I can really get into more. And I think Zizuma, Zizuma Void also mentioned it and I forget what he said though which is actually a good thing I'm glad I forgot what he said so I am wanting to just play at the controls now wooden hammer or probably any hammer maybe is used to break these walls so I want to see figure out how to make that hammer um, apparently Mr. Bling down in the water over there somewhere who's swimming underwater constantly will teach me that recipe eventually. Um, but I don't know how I feel about that. I mean, I guess it isn't. Okay. Yes, yeah, so I don't really think I need to learn the controls so much as realize that right clicking uses it and using it includes placing blocks if it's a block I'm using um, left click does nothing for most things it looks like nope so right click only I don't know what left click will be used for But, and then I changed my throw key to C, which is my drop key normally. So do these torches, did the torches attach to the wall? No, I, I wonder if they'll despawn eventually. So I'll throw one down there, and when I come back from my daily exploration, which perfect timing, it's coming up right now. But I want to explore outwards and see things. Explore the terrain first. I think that's a good way to really start an adventure. Um, I will need some. I do want to collect some resources while I'm out here. Um, I do know there's an extensive cave world beneath, but I've seen no indication of where that could be yet. So I want to maybe see if there's an opening on the surface somewhere and if that's the typical way to find caves or if digging down like I was that, that little base is the proper way. And it seems we have company. I did not hit the right button. I did not want to shoot arrows. Okay. I do want gels though, that's another good reason to search the surface. Iron ore. I will take iron ore. Ooh, 
it's that that's the iron ore, but it looked the same to me, so maybe it's just I'm new to this game feeling that's a lot of wood. Do not go anywhere with that. <laughs> so uh so so far I feel like I'm high up in the world for some reason. Like this is the tallest mountain or something. I wonder if I could pick up these sunflowers. Meanwhile, we have slimy company. Okay, so I do not have a wooden hammer yet, and it looks like the sunflowers are in the background, so... Maybe wooden hammer just picks everything in the background? That seems like a logical assumption. Maybe. This tree looks huge. And I just walked past the slime, apparently. Wait, I think I picked something up. They bloom seeds. Oh! Stop interrupting me looking at they bloom seeds. Thank you. So maybe I have to hit the ground instead, so... Let's go look at that. And I guess I did see some cave over there. So let's hit the ground. Yes, I got it. I got some sunflowers. Ha! So I mine the grass, and then the grass gives me it. Okay, makes sense to me. Oh! I would love some better weapons, though. Probably. I wonder if there's stone tools or if iron is the next thing. I am getting a lot of gel, which is good, even if it is taking life away. Holy cow! That arrow took out a lot. Lesser healing potion. Let's use that. Restore 50 life. I could probably reheal this over time, but I want to see how to use it. Aha! Now it won't let me. There's an X over it. Okay. Let's place some torches down. Near me, preferably. Oh! That was unintended. Just want to see. Oh! That's unintended too. Um, am I supposed to break these? Can I access them some other way? Just wanted a gel. Because I am getting low. Um, let's craft some of this. Okay. I just felt a little low there. Um... So we seem to have a cave here. That's that's a good sign. I like that. Um I wonder if breaking these are a bad idea. And what is this? More clay. Okay. Um and I wonder if lighting up actually does anything other than make everything visible. But there are vines and these look really cool. Didn't, doesn't seem collectible though, with the pickaxe at least. Hmm. I kind of want to explore the cave at night, because I feel like all the mobs would be on top. And I do want more gels, and the only time I've seen gel is, is during the day on the surface. Okay, and it looks like to practice some block placing time so I don't have much dirt oh no I have I guess I have a full stack of dirt on the zero slot ow come on thank you and let's go to dirt and I guess we have to chop this tree out of the way first if I guess you can't change mid-swing, or my 4 key was stuck. But, let's keep going. These trees are in the way. And that 
It's hindering me. Let's go. I got more acorns, so let's go to zero and um parkour our way over there kind of. Oh, this could be bad. Yep. Whoa, you jumped far further than I imagined. So the blue guys seem tougher and stronger. Ooh. My throat punched up there a bit. Let's go. So we're even higher than the highest points. That's always a good sign on getting it right. So let's keep going down. I do also wonder how long an in-game day is. And... Okay, I made it out, thankfully. Is this more stone or... Come on! So the blue guys also seem to only go one direction, but the green guys can turn around. And they're not letting me... Okay, this is just more stone. Okay. Oh yeah, look at that move. Nope, that blue guy turned around. Okay. I wonder why he turned around. If it was because of me or because of some mountain thing. So we have a long lake. I am looking at the sun just to make sure. Okay, so I can stand in this too high water without drowning. Um, is this stone too? Looks, yep. So stone looks like this. I wonder if there are texture packs for this game. Probably a really silly question, but I do wonder that. What's this? Okay, it's most, more stone. I wonder if that surface iron was an oddity. What is this? Oh, mud block. Interesting. Okay, we have two different types of stone going on over here, and this seems to be like swampland. I'm guessing this is swamp because it has mud and lots of water, and there is a fish in there. I did see that. So this is stone, it appears normal to me. Let's put a torch down. But there is something beneath this stone. I see it, it's right here. And I'm thinking it could be iron. Oh, no! Stop. Okay, yeah, there's slightly too many slimes out. It's hindering a lot of progress that could be could have been made. You know I do like farming though. Actually I wonder if it's possible to even farm. Okay, we have some iron ore. This is good. Music just changed. The music has definitely changed. Is that signifying anything that could possibly be dangerous? I did not want to place it on the iron ore, but oh well. It doesn't sound like danger music. Danger. Oh, the torch auto adjusted to the wall. That's nice. So we have. 
looks like there's more stuff below. Mud. Hmm. Oh. Time to test my non-existent Terraria parkour skills. <laughs> come on, come on. Come on, slimes. Oh no, I'm too far away from home to even try. And too far away. Oh, I guess I could try. Let's hurry. Come on, let's make it. And not die to a blue slime. Yes. Potion drunk. <laughs> so my potions are gone. Bunny! Are you evil? Oh no! I just killed a bunny! Oh my gosh. I'm sorry, Bunny. I did not mean that. I guess I'm the evil one. I wonder if... Oh man, that, that makes me feel bad. Poor bunny didn't stand a chance to my my poor skills. Oh dear. And okay, the cave's right there. I think I can make it safely. We'll see though. Come on, die. Okay, and then I want, actually I want to equip, oh this ammo disappears after the sunrise. I don't want to really mess with that right now. Okay, so I don't want to have clay. I much prefer to have blocks somewhere I can reach. Okay, there's another bunny over there. But I think I sealed this way good enough. Let's light some more torches. Oh, did that? Oh my goodness, this game is cruel to bunnies. I was not expecting that. Aha! <laughs> yes, throwing stuff, throwing torches. That's that's a good feature. And apparently placing torches breaks these pots, so I doubt these pots are supposed to really stay. Wait, there's a treasure chest. Chest. 15 torch. 4 lesser healing potions. Thank you. Let's open his chest again. Oh! Consumable. 10 range damage. Okay. Oh no. The only thing I can see is I can, I can, can't, I can't attack. Ooh! Boomerang! <laughs> oh man, there's a lot of weapons in this game. Bunny? Are you coming for revenge? No, you just want to walk right past. Okay, there's zomb two zombies out there. There's zombies all around. So I still want to know how much I have to light up. And... Is this chest takeable? Actually, is this stuff... I can put stuff in chest. All right, now we're talking. Um, actually, I do want to just give, make this a new base, I guess. Let's put a workbench down. Um, ooh, yes, wooden hammer. What does it take? Oh, just more wood. Okay. Um. I do not need an axe underground. I think axe and hammers will be able to switch out more. Um, furnace. I will need another furnace. 
so many zombies. There we go. Um, iron. I have iron ore. How much of it? 41? No. 15. Okay, so I have more iron ore. That's always good. Mudstone block. Red brick. Bowl. Pink vase. What's this require? Four clay. I want to try to sell. And nothing. Well, let me place. So maybe it's something else later on. I don't know. Let's go back to the workbench. And door sign chest. How much? Oh, it requires two iron too. It's good to know. Eight wood, two iron. Okay, wooden table. How much wood do I have? 250? No, more than that. Okay, I'll make another wooden table. Let's, um... Find a place to put this down. Uh, maybe you can put the vase on it. And then... Yes, I can! Aha! And I can pick it back up. Perfect. That's good to know. Um, workbench. What's this? Iron anvil. Use to craft iron uh, items from metal bars. There we go. Ooh, yes. Iron bow. Iron sword. Iron short and broad sword. Okay, so the short swords are very fast speeds, and these are hit harder. Trash can, empty bucket. Okay, I can I know all of those. Um, I would want eight iron, seven iron, seven. I can only make one of these. Iron chain. That's probably important later on. Let's put that away and let's put this bow in the chest. And how are my arrows doing? 36, it's good. Drill, acorn. We have day bloom seeds. Acorns, I now can plant trees. Lens, I missed that. Um, I actually kind of want to keep these in my inventory just in case it's used for an obscure crafting recipe that I just don't know yet. And I have one iron left. Um, I want to go caving now though. So I'm going to put this in the chest. And copper bar can put in the chest. Deposit all. So I have one more. Okay. I missed that. Day bloom and day bloom seeds. So maybe they're just plant some flowers, I guess. Farm some flowers, that'd be cool. And meanwhile I just want to create some more torches. Flaming arrows. That seems good. So let's go. Oh, I didn't look for m new pickaxes. Maybe they require more iron than what the anvil offered me. So let's go down. Meanwhile, I did not go very far. I cannot throw very far horizontally. It's good to know. I need to learn quicker torch placement. There's stone there. Okay, more pots. Oh, what? What? I guess some place is not lit up m more. 
Alright. Please tell me that. If lighting it up actually helps with mobs. Um and if so, how much it would help. Okay, there's some more iron here. That's not iron, it's stone. Oh, and there's some copper ore. Okay, so copper ore is that red stuff. But I did want to mention that um, I didn't. Th I don't think I did last video, but um, spoilers. I'm semi open to them if it's related to what I was doing and I or directly asked it or I'm obviously confused about it and stuff like that but as far as like sand but as far as most things go don't spoil things that I don't have not found yet or have not really seen yet um there's a jellyfish over there Interesting. And I trapped myself. Ooh. So, sand works like Minecraft, I guess. In which it's affected by gravity. Well, I wouldn't mind taking some sand blocks. Maybe we could craft some more lenses or something in the furnace. Torch, torch, torch. There we go. Okay, stone blocks, dirt blocks, nothing new. So let's, um, Um, let's get up here. Come on, get out of my way, please. God, so much in my way. Sorry about that. Um, my nose is funny and I had to um, blow it. Uh, <laughs> I came out odd, but oh well. Might get it, but um, was thinking during that little brief moment that this might have been good progress for blind. Um, I did figure out a lot more things. Um, I got an iron bow, and that's cool. And looking forward to exploring some more, but it will have to be some other time. And. I appreciate you watching. So, this is Dungan, and I will see you next time.